Hey, what's up, guys? This is Rush22211 again, and in this tutorial today, I'll be showing you how you can get AutoCAD 2012 for free, of course. Um, just to let you know, there are a few requirements you need to be able to, you know, download the Autodesk software. Um, mainly the first thing you want to do is, um, you want to make sure that you're a student, mainly. You have to be a student, a school student, you have to be a teacher. You have to be, you know, a registered student at a school. Um, high school, middle school, it really doesn't matter. Um, as you can see, I have the student version. You can see, you know, at the top, top here, it says student version of AutoCAD 2012. Um, if many of you are familiar with AutoCAD, you know how to operate it. Um, you know, just insert simple lines and crap like that, you know, start points, specifying points, you know. So, the only problem is if you put AutoCAD in your laptop, it doesn't matter what type of laptop it is, it is going to be kind of laggy. Especially for the 32-bit version. I do have the 32-bit version on my laptop, and it is, you know, pretty laggy. That's why I re I'd rather have it on my new desktop than on my laptop, but I still have it on my laptop from when I'm at school and stuff. So, minimize this tab here, and then the first thing you want to do is you want to go into your browser if you're choosing. Once it opens up, um, go to Google, and then you want to type in Autodesk Student Download. Then it'll say Autodesk, Autodesk Education Community. Click it, it'll be the first link that pops up here. Um, while I connect for a minute. <coughs> then you'll get the Autodesk Education Community page here. Build your knowledge with online resources, etc. Um, and then you will obviously see you have a list. At literally every single Autodesk software is here. You can download. It starts with basic AutoCAD all the way to Rivet Architecture, <laughs> all the way to Autodesk Soft Image. So, first thing you want to do to be able to create your account to be able to download it is just go up to Register. Then you'll be prompted with your email, confirmation email, then I am. A student, you can be a faculty teacher, um, a mentor, coach, or unemployed, I guess. But you have to be one of these. Um, I'm really not sure about unemployed, but you have to be one of these, and you have to be legit. It has to be legit because they will search the database of whatever company you're working for to make sure that you're um, a registered student or teacher. Once you go through that, go to step two, then step three. Then once you have your account, you know, set up just go ahead and go back to your software suite and then just go ahead and download um, one of the AutoCAD or Autodesk softwares if you're choosing um, that's really all I can say from here um, no matter what type of internet connection you have this is a pretty big software all of these softwares are pretty big um, if you choose one of the main AutoCAD softwares it will you know it will take up mostly a whole gigabyte out of your hard drive I, um, mine took up a gig and a half 1.5 gigs, so be prepared for that. Make sure you have a you know a pretty a pretty big hard drive allocated on your computer just to make sure you know it doesn't kill your hard drive and take up all the space that you might have needed for another different program. But um, it will work. Just be patient with it. It will take about two hours to download, two hours to you know an hour and a half depending on the type of internet con connection you have. But either way, it will at least be an hour or more. So. Thanks for watching, and I hope this video helps. AutoCAD really is a good, it really is a good software, especially when you're in high school, and especially when you're out in the business world. So, it's really AutoCAD really helps me out, and it's a really good software to use if you're wanting to build stuff and design um, your own products. So, um, thanks for watching. As always, comment, rate, subscribe, and I hope this helps you guys out. Thanks for watching.